Hello and welcome everyone, I'm Clammy and I'm here with another redstone tutorial showing you all how to make a working microwave in Minecraft. Yes, it has all the necessary sounds that you'll need for a microwave, so it's pretty badass. Your friends will think it's pretty sweet too, so here's a little demonstration. Hear that? That was pretty sweet. So, for example, say if you were, um, I don't know, say if this is your house and you have like a chest over here and I don't know, crafting table, and uh, you come home after a hard day of mining, right? So you put this in here, you're making some food, you're doing whatever you're doing, you know, you have your uh, chest, you're, I don't know, putting stuff away, then boom, oh, my food's ready. Bam. Oh, it's not actually ready. But, that's, that's pretty useful, and it's just, uh, it's a nice luxury, so let's get to the tutorial. Alright, so enough for the actual tutorial. Uh, the items in my hotbar are all you'll need, not the actual quantity, but the items themselves. So, uh, let's get started. So you'll want to place down your furnace. And this is pretty similar to my other video, the hidden furnace room. If you've seen that, then it's it's a pretty similar process. So you'll place a sticky piston behind the furnace facing to the right. Uh, you'll want to dig a hole, and then put a torch there, and then a block right there. So that'll give you some power. So now behind the sticky piston, you want to place three blocks like that, and then one up like this. And place a redstone repeater on its fourth pick. And then some redstone there, and there, and just run it along like that. That didn't sound very good. Okay, there we go. So now, on the left side, you want to place some redstone right there. A block. A torch. And then place a redstone repeater this way on its fourth tick, and then run some redstone like that. And now uh, you're pretty much done here, this will work. But uh, you actually want the sound, obviously, so let's place some <clears throat> redstone. And you want a wall here to kind of hide all this, so let's just kind of give a nice visual rep representation. Well, and uh, so let's place. Oh, yeah, yeah, actually, you know what? You'll need some glass to make that kind of like solid ticking sound. So, place some glass, and it'll block, and I'll give you like that solid ticking sound. And now over here, let's run some redstone from the last kind of like turn off here. So like one, two, I think that, well yeah, it'll work, okay. So one, two. You want it to be far enough away from here so when this pushes out, it won't actually destroy this. Put these both on the fourth tick, and then place your note block, and this is what it's gonna kind of sound like. It's gonna be the ding after it's done cooking. So I'll put some a nice high sound. And uh, here you are. You are done. So let's test this out. Let's get some. Uh, let's get a stick because that cooks the fastest. And uh, let's get some raw pork chop. So here we go. See that glass gives that solid ticking sound. And then ding, it's done. Although it's not actually done, it just kind of dings after this uh, the fuel's gone. But usually it does after it's done cooking. So if you used coal, it would last until it's done cooking. And uh, yeah, that's, that's it. That's easy. It's compact. Uh, it's it's a nice luxury. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching and stay moist.